Hello fellow YouTube, it's MKPS here, and today we're going to talk about why she does Knoxville, and then we'll get to the trades that I did. Um, so, I know it was my fault for doing so bad at the tournament. Six, oh, six losses and two wins. I got the tournament right, cool. Um... Um, and the start of the event, uh, we'll get to that in a minute. So, so the only decks I won against was Destiny, Exodia, and Madoka's, 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 I think it's an old Link deck with a bunch of women, that, some of them are pretty hot. But, um, yeah, so... Okay, we talked about that. Oh, okay. So, next will be the vendors. The vendors were pretty good. Except the vendor I got this from. But, I'm not going to say no names. I don't want to get banned. I just said they were doing some shady business. But, um... The other bad thing was... Unofficial deers. They are... This went to Trey, and one of the worst ones in Knoxville was there. I didn't recognize him because he, he looked so different from he know he normally looks when I do see him. Uh, he's like an he's an Asian dude, but his hair that day, the, both days at YCS, his hair was a mess. He didn't look clean, presentable like he always did when I saw him six months ago. But um. He screwed me the worses. When I added it up, it was like at least three hundred dollars worth of cards for this and um, twenty bucks. Cause I didn't know if, uh, Jimzo was worth money. He had a, he got a stack about like that big, bigger than this stack. Out of my tray binder. And all he and all I wanted from him was this. And he should have gave this to me for three ash blossoms, but no. So that was my day one. Yeah. This is all I got day one. And I think some of this I got day one. Oh I got I definitely know I got these from a vendor day one. But, um, day two, when my binder got better, when I found more cards I could sell, I didn't know a secret rare elementary hero Sparkman from, like, a Target collection from years ago was worth $30. He was, he only told me it was worth 10 and gave me these three for it. When I added these up, they were only like eight bucks for the whole all three, so I got burned there. Um, this trade was a lot more fair because I got he did get a big stack for me, but I got a lot of stuff I wanted. I know I got ripped off, but not as nearly as bad as the Suruja trade. Still a little mad because some of these conditions are not the best. Especially one of the very important heroes being damaged. But that's what you get when you're dealing with a uh, rip off officers. Um, my stepbrother traded me these. He also wanted me to have a mint. Imperial Order, in case anyone called me out, having a damage one in my main. Um, and then the last tray, I had a movie pack. Uh, oh, the mo the promo you got from the Yu Gi Oh movie when it first came to the show. The theater pack, 
and I got these two for it. And these are all movie pack versions of these particular cars, not the dual power. So let's talk about the vendors. This I think I did decent. Two bucks or oh, six bucks for the playset. A little off axe lance. Damn, that camera sucks. Well, there you go. Okay. I know 50 cents for this was high. Um, I got these for three bucks. Each. Three seventy-five. Technically, I paid four bucks for it. Because I got ripped off. I was told to grab a common when I bought this, but I was being the little good guy. But um, then we have uh, what dark player? Yeah, dark road. That was a dollar. And then all these commons were um, twenty cents. I know that one was like a dollar now. That's like. Almost two bucks. I think that's a dollar. It's like 50 cents. Um, but you sure got, I got girls worth a little bit. I needed one of these swords. Um, Well, I wanted to have a bunch of these and Dark Rider, so. Got me a bunch of lilies as well. Come and go one. Bunch of Wayburns. Good saber to get rid of the hollow. Got a place set of these again. Um. Nice to find God, five God Dragon. Some blue eye shinies. Mm, elemental hero dude. Tunings. Original art blue eyes and dark magicians. My personal favorite artwork, Dark Paladin. A Jimzo. And then these I did buy. I'm pretty sure I paid nine a piece for these. I got a little ripped. This was 31. And I'm pretty sure this was 12 when I picked when I bought picked it up. And I know the I know all these but this one have dropped hardcore since then. And that's pretty much my YCS pickup. Um, and trades and bought when I was at YCS Knoxville. Um, so I'll see you guys in my next video. I'll probably put back together the deck that I played. I kind of changed it when I got more of these. So, no, because I think I'm main decking all the all these that I bought for it. Oh, and I'm also main decking the Sudo Jack just because I have it now. So I didn't think that's my most expensive card I own now. So you guys, let me know. Peace.